Hey guys, today I'm unboxing and sharing an optic that I was really excited to receive. I've been working with the Amazon seller Fiatchi for a while now, mainly providing Amazon reviews. I've received a few optics in the past, including the RS25, as well as the RDS25. They reached out to me again, offering me any product in their catalog for review, and I immediately had my eyes on the V30 red dot sight. The V30 is rugged, modular, it looks amazing, and it's extremely easy to operate. It's actually exactly what I was looking for for my upcoming SMG build. The Feiyachi V30 ships in a protective case just like all of the other products that I've received from them. Popping the case open and we're presented with the optic. Digging in a little further and we have all the product accessories and hardware. Included in the package for the V30 are a front and rear flip up lens cover, an alternate height mount for a low profile setup, an Allen key, star key, an extra battery, all the hardware needed to mount the sight, a lens wipe, and the product manual. I'll unwrap everything here and we can take a look at setting up the optic. So overall, the build quality is very solid. There's no wobble at all and the optic is made of metal. I really love the choice to use a three button system here. There are no dials to adjust, simply an on and off button, and then two corresponding brighter and dimmer settings for the reticle. Pressing the on button once will ignite the red dot. The V30 has 11 different brightness settings and it's a red dot only. The optic has a one hour automatic shutoff, as well as a motion sensor that will turn the optic back on as soon as it senses any significant movement. Another key feature that I'm very happy with is the removable lens shade. This front side hexagonal lens cover is usually used for preventing your targets from seeing your lens flare. But in my case, I love having this removable lens protector for airsoft purposes. This hexagonal lens cap may stop a BB from breaking your sight as is, but personally, I'll usually punch out the hexagonal grate and replace it with a circular piece of durable plastic. This will just prevent the V30 from being able to be shot out or cracked due to any crazy circumstances on the field. Looking at the flip-up lens covers, they are a durable plastic that snap on and off as needed. The lenses can then flip up and down depending on when it's in use. As an Airsoft YouTuber when picking out this product, I also had my eye on the mounting system when choosing the sight. This may be insignificant for most, but I do appreciate the fact that I can run a wire through the base of the mount if needed. That just cleans up any loose wires from any rail attachments or weapon mounted cameras that I may be running on my rifle. My absolute favorite feature of this sight is regarding the windage and elevation adjustment knobs. I'm a precision player. I'm always trying to sight my optics in the best that I can. With the Feiyachi V30, when you remove the protective caps to access the windage and elevation dials, the caps themselves provide the tools needed to make the adjustments. This means it's as easy as can be to access and adjust these settings while out on the field or away from your tools. With 11 different settings, the V30's reticle brightness is adjusted via the button inputs on the side, meaning that the adjustment dial on top is purely aesthetic and only serves as the optics battery compartment. The optic ships with a battery installed as well as a replacement. This is great for allowing the product to get a lot of use before any outside purchases are needed to keep it maintained. Here is the secondary mount that's included in the package. To change out the mount, simply unscrew the four hex screws in the base of the mount. Transfer the screws into the other mount, and then tighten the mount back on the bottom of the sight. As you can see with the optic side by side, with the shorter mount installed, the optic sits almost flush on the rail space. To install the V30 onto a Picatinny rail, simply loosen the mount and then tighten it in place with the provided star key. Is the Fiatchi V30 worth the price point? Yes, absolutely. For the current price of around $70 on Amazon, you get a very solid, high quality red dot sight with 11 different brightness settings that provides two unique mounting options and a handful of accessories. I do wholeheartedly suggest this optic if it's the style you're looking for for your red dot. 
this optic will hold up and last on the field. I can speak into Feiyachi's durability as I have been using one of their cheaper red dots, the RDS-25, on my hardest kicking gas blowback rifle for over two years. The optic stays sighted in and it continues to perform when I need it to. The Fiaci V30 is my new primary one-times optic. It has all the features I was looking for, as well as a few that I didn't even know I needed. You can find this optic on their Amazon store, the seller name is Fiaci, or you can just use the link that I've provided in the description below. Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell to see this optic in use, as well as the awesome upcoming KWA QRF Mod 1 build that I specifically chose this optic for. Thanks for checking out the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.